Our chair of the United Private Hire Drivers branch of the IWGB Union. Uh, we've got some big news for you. Um, London, Birmingham and Nottingham have all voted to go on strike against Uber this week on Tuesday for 24 hours. That's uh, on Tuesday from 1 p.m. to Wednesday, 1 p.m. 24 hour strike for Uber drivers in those three, city, three cities. Now, if you're um, in any other city in the UK, you want to get involved in this, um, please contact your local rep um, or contact us and we will advise you. But uh, certainly this is likely to, um, to spread throughout the UK. Um, there are four key demands. The first one is that we want to see the fares increased uh, from, uh, from current levels to uh, two pounds per mile. We want to see the commission reduced to 15%. Uh, we want to see the end of unfair deactivations. We're seeing too many deactivations for uh, for frivolous or no reason. Uh, it's got to change. We've got to have a proper um, dismissal and appeals process. And finally, we want to see worker rights protection like we're fighting for in court because that effectively puts a bottom in the marketplace, a floor in the marketplace below which nobody can sink and everybody can rise. Um, why now? Well, um, there's momentum. Uh, the biggest player in Silicon Valley is Amazon, and they just um, gave a big increase uh, to their workers uh, last week after a, a lengthy campaign. Uh, so if uh, Amazon is king of uh, Silicon Valley, it's time for us to turn the screw on Uber as well. Um, there's been some momentum here in the UK with the McDonald's workers, TGI Fridays, Weatherspoons, uh, and Uber Eats all out on strike last week, and we supported them. Uh, in fact, we went to Uber's head office last Thursday and we had a demonstration there. And because there's so much public interest in this now, now's the time for Uber drivers not to be silent. Now's the time for Uber drivers to step forward and make our grievances known that we're not paid properly, uh, that we're not treated well in terms of insecurity. You can be knocked off the app at any time for any reason or no reason at all. Um, and that the commissions are too high. Uh, the commissions are effectively what we're effectively doing here with these unsustainable fares and high commissions is we're funding Uber's growth because what Uber needs to do is show that it's uh, growing very fast uh, because it's uh, looking to float on the stock market next year. And uh, we're paying for that. And that's, that's certainly not fair. Um, uh, the underlying business model at Uber is very profitable. There's no reason why they should be charging drivers 25% at the scale that they're at right now. Uh, so we need to get something done about that. Uh, also because we're strong. Uh, we're strong, we're strong as a union. We've been organizing for three years and now's the time to call a strike. Now, look, I know that it's a big ask. I know 20, 24 hours off the app, uh, losing income is expensive uh, for some people, but I hope that you can mitigate it by planning your work week to take that day off anyway. If you could do that, that would be incredible. Um, but it's also important that we show solidarity. We show solidarity uh, with each other and that we're united uh, because honestly, united uh, together will never be defeated. Uh, disunity is what uh, Uber relies upon uh, and other big operators uh, and um, local councils and Transport for London. They absolutely rely on driver disunity in order for exploitation and unfair treatment to continue. Uh, I hope that we can approach the strike this week in great unity, in great dignity, in great respect for one, and the, one another in what we're about to do. We've got a ton of support behind us. Uh, our social media has just gone viral. Um, so I hope that we can take advantage of this, um, have a great uh, strike day on Tuesday. Please join the demonstrations. Please contact your rep. Please contact us. Uh, and join in and uh, please keep off the app. One more important, really important thing is that we're also appealing to the general public to stay off the app as well. So uh, the response to that social media has been fantastic. We'll be working on that uh, through every channel available to us over the next couple of days. Um, because I think that's also part of making the hit on Uber so that they know we've got power, they know we've got support out there. Um, and look at our social media, you will see that there is There's a lot of support for us. There's a lot of support for you. And now it's time to turn the screw. Uh, so uh, do join the protests. Let's 